back. You watch. He'll come All right. back. All right. Now, he, he's, uh, let's talk color of buzz bait. Okay. There are some days when it, it seems like, <laughs> I can't get on the subject now. This fish has got me all worked up. It seems like no no color matters. Whatever you throw in a buzz bait works. Really? You know, I've had those days. How about uh, type of blades? Now, you're using a metal. Do you think metal is better than plastic? Definitely. You do? Definitely. Noisier. Okay. The more noise you make, the better off you are. That's what I found on them. And do you find any time of year they work better? Or? June. June's a good month. June, July. Both months. Okay. The, probably the hottest months for buzz baiting. You know that last pike hit me three times and I missed him every time? Do you have that happen a lot? There, there. Oh, that's a bass, I bet you. I lost him. He yeah, was right I was. Under the boat. He was right that's under the be boat. A bass. Man. Did you see him break water when he hit? I guess you did. You cast right where I lost him. <laughs> he probably you were right. Come back, because my experience with bass is once they once no, they, they won't. They're not anything like a pike. They're, I think they're a lot smarter. Although I don't know, but you're right. He was right under the boats. Ray said, uh, "Now we're getting back to where we launched our boats in Fort Co our boat in Fort Covington." And he said, "Don't worry. There's fish right up here by the village, right under the boats." And boy, you were right. That I think was another nice bass. Well, guys. It's just about time that we've got a call of the day. And I know, Ray, that ironically, I'm doing it for your, your benefit since you got a date tonight to play in the band. We've got to go in and pack the car, right? <laughs> I don't hear anything back there. I don't want to go. You don't? <laughs> you tell the owner of that restaurant that you've... Uh, contracted that. <laughs> well, I want to thank you guys. Irv, you have been just absolutely super. Have you? You better believe it. You enjoyed driving that boat with your steering car, or your Watching you guys. cables coming undone? And oh, yeah. I enjoyed it. Yeah. Well, but I sure want to thank uh, you. If it wasn't for you, you know, we wouldn't have been able to do this today. Yeah. So it was really nice of you. And Ray, yeah. I want to thank you, too. I had a ball. I really did. Do you do you enjoy this as much as you pretend, or as you seem to do? Nobody believes me when they when they when I tell them how much I like fishing. It's priority priority over most anything. Most anything again, huh? Most anything. There's a couple things to take priority. Well, you know something. We started out today, and our whole goal was to fish walleyes. You'd been doing well up here, and we went out there and we tried our best. We really did. We gave it our all, but it wasn't quite enough since that wind was so strong and the sky was so bright. Now it's getting overcast and they probably hit. Conditions look, look pretty perfect right now. <laughs> I'll tell you, I enjoyed this here in the river every bit as much or maybe more than if we'd have gone out there and trolled or drifted through that heavy current for walleyes. I really did. Yeah. Well, there's not a dissatisfying point about fishing. <laughs> I, can't, I can't find any anyway, as long as you're doing what you really like to do. Well, I'll yeah. tell you what. Will you do it again with me? Will you do it again with me? Yep. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that sweet? <laughs> we'll see you next week on Rod and Streamside. One of the best ways to really see the country is on a bus trip. We'll be riding the dog from Seattle to Chicago on the next edition of Travels. We've got your bus ticket tomorrow night at 8 on TV25. The Blessed, the Damned, the battle between good and evil in stone and glass. The people of medieval Europe left behind a religious and artistic legacy of an ongoing struggle, the struggle to be human. They left behind a white garment of churches. Next time on Art of the Western World. Tomorrow night at 9 on TV 25. Broadcast of the Joy of Painting is made possible by a grant from Craft and Flower Limited with 12 locations to serve you in northeastern Ohio, offering a complete line of art supplies featuring Bob Ross products and publications.